Hey everyone, it's your buddy Graphic back with another video, and today I want to show you guys some PvP clips. So we're going to start off with one clip that I actually had, I think, two really, really nice snipes to finish people off. Uh, and you get to see some great bow gameplay, you know. I typically don't hit every shot, and I definitely didn't do that this time around. I didn't hit every shot, but for the most part, I hit some pretty clutch shots to where people would probably get away if I didn't hit them. And that's kind of what we're showcasing here. But there was a great little fight here as well. You know, I'm getting stuttered steps there by Path of Destiny. Um, I get a nice evade shot, almost hit, but unfortunately I missed there. Kind of a risky shot to take. Still missing a lot of shots, but thankfully I have a very, very solid team going in hot. I'm going to try to get in there with my rapier as well. As we get closer and closer, I'm getting heals, which is great. I'm just trying to get some attacks down. So, you know, when you auto somebody, when you do melee attack damage to somebody, you are able to slow them down just by meleeing them. You saw there I got a nice repost, got a kill. Here I'm getting kind of clumber or kind of clustered. I'm trying to evade out, but uh, I guess my weapon didn't swap for me there. So I'm trying to do a circle here, replenish my health a little bit before I go back in. Uh, at this point, I am ready to go. It's, you know, that I still have that poison ticking on me. It's now just finally going away. We are getting this kill right here, so I'm not too worried about him. Um, but then, you know, we get the kill. I was trying to get the reset, so I'd have my flesh back up. Miss that. So we have a one-shot guy. I'm trying to hit that shot, miss it barely. Um, then we're going to have another chance right here, and we wait for it. We get that kill. So that's one of the kills that I was pretty happy with. And then we have more runners, right? So they're all trying to run away. I try to hit a poison shot on that, uh, you know, a headshot poison shot because that's probably the only way I'm going to kill that guy there. But we do have some more runners here. We're able to shoot him twice, get that kill. Uh, and then we have some deep, deep runners, right? So we have a couple weak ones. And we're going to be able to shoot one more time here. Hopefully hitting this level looks like 24 or 34. Now I'm like at level 31, so I should be able to destroy him with a, a good bow shot here. But looks like he's taken out as well. As we get closer to this back line, there are going to be some more weak ones that we get to shoot at here around this corner. So we're going to try one more shot here, it looks like, going up this little... Um, little ramp here. We're going to try to cut them off. The big deal is here is we have people on the right side kind of pushing them left, and I'm on the left side trying to basically get an auto attack off to slow them down. So we're getting in range to be able to actually auto attack both of them, and that's exactly what I'm going for. So I get an auto attack on their ice gauntlet user. Try to get an auto. I got an auto on both. So that's the big play there for me, um, being able to get my teammates over here and closer to the fight in action. Uh, I'm actually with a random 27, but you see that snipe right there, a very, very solid shot that uh, took that guy out, and we were actually able to get both of the runners with this build. That's why I love the Rapier Bow build, by the way. So much mobility, so much uh, different, really, utility that you have there. Obviously, damage as well. So on this clip, guys, we're going to see that we just came out of the town. We have about 25 seconds, 24 seconds before we can actually fight because I heard that there was fights going on outside uh, by my company. They were trying to stop, I believe, a push in Everfall as we own Everfall and we're trying to defend it. So, you know, I have about 10 seconds left before I should even shoot. There's really no reason to shoot yet. Uh, but, you know, right now, I believe we are outnumbered. I believe, you know, you can see, what, five over there. We have five over here. Uh, so we'll see how this fight goes. I'm not sure exactly how this one ends up. I kind of forget, but this was definitely one I wanted to show. So we'll see what happens. We did get some damage down there to start it off. Uh, some decent poison shots and stuff. We have more action going on over here. Like I said, a very, very big outnumbering. Uh, we're going to try to take the live staff user out because the live staff user is going to be the one that obviously is keeping everyone alive. And that's exactly what we did. So we took him out very, very quickly, which is definitely a very, very big bonus to us greens. Um, I wanted to make sure we got that kill real quickly in case I died because, like I said, there's a lot of people here, a lot of purple specifically. But I think we are getting more reinforcements on the green side. Uh, so, you know, we are kind of baiting them into a little bit closer into this farm area. Uh, you know, we don't want to really run into the settlement. I hate, you know, the players that just continuously run in. I'd rather die outside than run back in. But right now we're getting some decent shots on uh, this guy in the farm. He's pretty weak. He's got a poison on him. I'm hitting more shots. He's about 1 HP. I got a hammer guy on me. Going to just repost him and keep running. Um, trying to kite and be with the team, right? So we have about, what, three people at this point, four people at this point against, what, probably eight or ten? So we're still outnumbered pretty heavily. I'm trying to help this guy over here, uh, getting him some shots on the uh, really the opposing team. You can see that you know, one of the Syndicate guys is very, very weak. What I do t occasionally here is, you know, I, I shoot too quickly, and that's when I start missing. You can see I'm starting to miss a lot of shots because I'm doing light attacks and shooting instantly. What I would prefer to do sometimes is definitely when I have some abilities is take a little bit more time. There was a decent penetrating shot. He just dodged it, unfortunately. So here I'm just running around pretty much missing every shot. I still wanted to showcase this one, though, like I said, because we were definitely outnumbered for this, and we've just gotten a ton of greens to come out and actually help fight, and I thought it was kind of a very, very solid... Um, really response to this purple outrage in the front of Everfall. Uh, you can see there's still a lot of purple alive, though. 
as I'm trying to get better with bow shots, and I knew at this point that we probably won. Uh, so I was trying to get a little bit better with bow shots. I'm sure we've all had those moments where we just cannot hit a shot, but, uh, you know, you'll have that. So here we have the shield, sword shield user. Um, you know, he's going to take a lot of shots before he dies, so we're going to try to kill him, but, um, you know, a lot of people starting to to show up for the green side. We have a lot less purples. I think we have, what, one or two purples left, about 10 greens at this point, so it swaps pretty well. We did a very, very good fight, though, and for the most part, like I said, that opened up that, uh, that Everfall so that they couldn't take or attack with PvP missions anymore and, put, like I said, put our put our ever fall into conflict here i'm flagged in another one second so now i'm flagged i'm able to attack i see a weak guy in the back flesh him get a nice backstab so we're actually going to have that flesh back up instantly because like i said we get that 80 percent cooldown since we have flesh leveled here we're hitting some nice shots we actually have a decent uh decent amount of people actually pretty weak from this uh, these bow shots i'm gonna hit from an ice gauntlet great axe player in the back so we're gonna try to take him out we get a nice flesh damage there um you know i just cannot get to him Finally, we get him stuck in a grab well. We are able to take him out. We have more fights going on, though. You know, we have uh, here, we have an Ice Gauntlet yet again. Ice Gauntlet's very, very strong. Um, I do think bow is a pretty good counter to Ice Gauntlet's, though. Uh, if you're going to play against an Ice Gauntlet, I think Ice Gauntlet in 1v1s beats about anything but a bow. Um, and that's just because, like I said, evade shot's so good for a penetrating shot. To get yourself out of those situations, you just have to hit your shots, basically. So that was a fun fight. Uh, a just decent fight right outside of town. This is a very interesting one. This was by no means a, you know, a skillful looking fight. But I thought it was kind of funny. We were in Dead Man's Cove just for the heck of it. Because we thought we saw PvP conflict. So we came up here. We did the whole Dead Man's Cove. And we are up top. And we see about, what, four or five players, I believe, at the bottom of Dead Man's Cove. So we're now just running towards them. Um, you know, we're like, what? 15 strong running into these five players down here Poor covenant they uh instantly one drops uh, we take that kill you know a couple more to actually drop but we are you know in a ton of different mobs right now so it is a slow little process here but you know we are able to burst them down very very quickly we take another one out and instantly i'm looking for the last guy i think this is the last guy greet over here uh, in his ice tome and or in tome and that never obviously works when you're the last man standing but uh, I think, look at that, there's actually one more, we got them all. So all five, pretty pretty fast kills. It was kind of just a fun situation to jump down on all five of those with like 10 or 15 strong. I can only imagine their point of view on, you know, 15 people dropping down on them. But here you can see that we have just one more funny kind of clip uh, for you guys here. We have three guys, I believe, chasing me and right behind me. And what you guys can do, I don't know if I do it here, but you can actually alt and scroll. So, or not scroll, but move your camera. If you hold alt and move your camera, you can actually see them running behind you. I believe I can 1v3 this, uh, but what I do have is three guys in my party that have been looking for PvP action, so I thought we'd go the fun route with this, right? So bring them over. I told them to start laying down in bushes, laying down in the trees, and uh, these three guys definitely wanted this kill, um, so they continue to chase. And, you know, one of the guys that's chasing me is not flagged, so I can only imagine what he's thinking, but... Um, you know, whatever. I, we we continue to run. We're getting, like I said, about 100 meters now from the people laying down in those bushes, laying down in the trees. So we're going to be able to smack them around here in a second. I just thought this was a kind of fun uh, little little thing that you guys can do if you have friends that uh, you want to PvP with. Lay them down in a bush, bait, bait some players in. Definitely can happen quite uh, quite easily in this game, which I love. So you can see here they go right into our into our group. They start chasing that guy. Me and Tabonamo take this guy out very quickly. Maybe. I think he actually gets, not away, but gets a little bit farther than we were hoping for. There we go. Get that kill. And they killed another guy on the side, I believe. Um, and then you can see one guy on the left, far left. He's running out. Those two guys are running out. But we did get, like I said, two of the four in that quick PvP action, a little sweep attack. So thank you guys again for tuning in. Make sure to like the video, subscribe to the channel if you guys like this kind of format when it comes down to PvP. I appreciate the awesome, you know, awesome support you guys continue to show. Uh, like I said, like the video, subscribe to the channel, turn notifications on. I'll see you guys all in the next one.